Today is actually Sunday, November 17th, 2013, but I thought since like a lot of things happened and on Monday I'll have to update you on like the whole weekend plus my Monday, I feel like I'll leave something out. So I'm just gonna start this footage today and then do some Monday footage and then that'll be that. So alright, my weekend. I haven't talked to you since Thursday. So my Friday, what happened? Friday school was fine, it was such a long day. That was like the longest week, even though it was a four day week because we had Monday off. Oh my goodness, it was just, it felt like it took forever to get through. I don't know, the long weekends always end up screwing us over in the long run, so I don't know how I feel about those. But after school was fun, I went ice skating with the boy. Oh my god, my legs were actually so sore afterwards. Like we only went for maybe 30, 40 minutes, but it was like, I don't know, it's been a while since I've skated and I didn't fall. It was good, That that was good. And I was so upset because he got footage on his phone, like, he wasn't in it, but he was, like, talking to me, and, like, he took a video of me skating and stuff around the rink, but I, he couldn't attach it for some reason, because I was like, you should send that, I'm gonna use it in one of my vlogs, and then he couldn't attach it, and it was so upsetting, and I didn't want to, like, inconvenience him, so I was just like, whatever, it's fine, Tess will take my word for it, but it would have been kind of nice to, like, prove to you that I have friends and a life, but whatever, I guess you'll just have to take my word. Um, and then Saturday, oh my god. Oh my god, Tess, senioritis is so hard. So you know how you say you have like an addiction with TV, you know? Like you watch your shows and you just, you just sit there and watch TV? I watched five consecutive chick flicks. That happened, like I just got home from work and then I just sat on the couch and I did not move until 2 a.m. Literally that is what happened, five. Five chick flicks, ten hours, ten hours, oh my god, oh my god, it was so bad. And the entire time, I was like, what am I doing? I have so much work to do. I can't, I can't right now, it's just so bad. And the only time I moved was to like, change snacks, I'd be like, oh, okay, there goes the last of the skinny pop, let's go search for blackberries in the fridge, and it was just so bad. It was so bad, but let's just not even talk about that right now because I'll just, I don't even know what I'm doing with my life. I don't want to think about that. So um, then today, today I did minimal amounts of homework in the morning. My trainer was out because she's going in for like a surgery sometime, so she couldn't do my workout this morning. So even lazier did not work out today. And then the boy came over and we watched um, 40 Year Old Virgin and the first half of Princess Diaries. And then he had to go to like a soccer banquet or something. It was so funny. On Saturday night, we were like trying to figure out our plans. I was like, yeah, we could go to like downtown Rochester and check it out. Or we could go to Lucky Strike or something like that. And then eventually the conversation just kind of dwindled down to, you know, kind of tired. Do you want to just sit on the basement couch and watch movies? And so that is what we did. Oh my god, it's I'm so lazy nowadays, it's so bad. I just, I hate this. I hate homework, and I hate senior year. I love senior year. I love senior year, but I just, like, these classes I'm taking. We, I have to do the stupid gov thing. It's due tomorrow, and I've done no homework today. So it's 9 p.m. currently, and I have this whole thing to write. I have to write a letter to my representative, my, like, district representative about an event that, or like a topic or issue that I care about, but I literally could not give like fewer fucks about this. Like if you asked me to, I could not physically do it because I just don't even care a little bit. Just like government, really? I, okay, it's wonderful people who can be involved in the politics of our country and they're all like, yeah, it's your country, you might as well be educated and informed. And I'm like, how about no? Because I don't care. I mean, ultimately, I know it affects me. I'm not going to be one of those people who's like, whatever, I'll just let everyone else do it. But I just, it doesn't interest me and people can do whatever. I feel like, I guess we're like, you know, upper middle class. We're okay. That sounds bad. This is, okay, maybe this is what happens when you know nothing about politics. Like, you sound like a jerk. <laughs> but, uh, other things I did today. Oh, um, I went to my girlfriend's house and we sent a package off. She's um, one of the girls I met at camp who lives in Michigan. She lives like 15 minutes from me, so that's cool. 
And um, we hung out and like sent out the package, and then we had like a late night run to FedEx, and then there was a Seven Eleven, so we got slushies, and that was that was pretty fun. But now I'm back at 9 p.m. and I have let's see, what do I have to do? I have my history thingy to write. I have English to read. I have an English presentation on Tuesday, and I got paired with like the best partner ever, so I'm getting all the work. I have to do all the work. Luckily, they're individual grades, so at least I'll probably end up getting a good grade. God damn. I wish it were just a paper so I could like do kind of bad because I've been like, oh my god, I've been kicking Shakespeare's ass. I've been doing so well in that class. But if it were a paper, I could just like kind of BS it and be done. But it's a presentation, so I don't want to look like an idiot in front of the class, so I have to actually try and god, it's just... I'm not feeling it, man. I'm just not feeling it. But I have all this stuff to do. And I have, tomorrow's a late start, but I have to get in early. I'm gonna get in at like 7 o'clock, so I have two hours to spend in the metal studio. I hate everything. I hate it so much. I say this every single video, but this is like, not, I, I think it more. I think it more than I actually say it. Like, I say it every video, but 24-7 in my head, all I can think about is how much I hate that room. And I just... I sound really like, I sound whiny. I'm being such a whiny little bitch right now. I'm sorry. I just want to like, slap myself. Cause I'm being pathetic, but right now I'm just, I need a pity party. Mm -hmm. It's upsetting. Everything is upsetting. Maybe it's just because I'm moody. Oh well, cannot be helped. Anyways, alright. So, I guess technically if I had to, I could wait until tomorrow to watch your video and annotate and like see your annotations, but I like doing that. So, maybe like if I actually get some work done, I will try and do that. So, alright, that is my Sunday update, and I will tell you about the happenings tomorrow, although I feel like nothing will happen because it's Monday and whatever. Oh, and I hope you're enjoying your weather out in Florida because over here we are having tornado warnings. We had like really intense rain. Oh my god, I was driving. I thought I was going to crash in like hydroplane or something. And the winds are getting intense. Although I'm just praying, dear God or Buddha or Allah or whoever runs this universe, can you just let a goddamn tree fall on the power line of our school like it did sophomore year? Can that just be a thing that happens? Because that would be so greatly appreciated. Obviously that's not gonna happen, it never happens. <laughs> Life is so hard. Okay, I'll update you later. All right, that's it for now. Bye. Hey, so I'm back and today is actually Monday, um, November 18th, 2013. Not too much to add, I guess. Just a typical Monday, all block day. Those are always fun, always super long. I got up at 6.45 so that I could go in work on my metals portfolio from seven to nine that was that was fun i'm making progress though which is good it's like kind of comforting and my metals teacher doesn't like seem to hate me as much now that i'm actually like showing initiative and coming in and doing things so that's good and um rest of the day went by kind of slowly just got a bunch of stuff back although i did well on my math test i got a 93 on my math test and then a 95 on my english test not so good on bio. I mean, I actually haven't gotten anything back from bio, but I'm just predicting in the future how I'm not going to do that well in bio. But I guess it was like a pretty good day, you know, did well on things. I have an English presentation tomorrow. Ooh, oh, I'll show you what I've been making. It only took like two and a half hours. Look at this. I had to, had to draw this up. I don't know if you can see it, but it's, it's for my poem. I'm doing a poem. And we have to analyze it, and it's kind of awkward because it's like a renaissance poem, but the people look vaguely Asian because the only type of people I know how to draw are like manga looking people, so there's that, I suppose. And I realized I have to get up at like 5 o'clock tomorrow because I need to get in at 7 to do my medals project, but then I also need to shower because I was too busy working on my poster tonight to shower and I can't just not shower my hair because it's like a mess right now. So that'll happen too. That's, that's fun stuff right there. Um, anything else happened today? I went to yoga, I suppose. That was a thing I did. Um, ate lunch in the Mel's room. I'm gonna live in there, basically, for like however long it takes up until like December, I suppose. I'm excited that you're coming back and I guess I've been looking at the date and as of midnight tonight it's probably gonna be a little rough for you isn't it text me if you need to or if you don't feel like it then you know 
do whatever works for you. I hope everything's okay, though. I mean, that's stupid. It's definitely not gonna feel okay tonight, but you know, I hope that you deal okay, because that's what we do. We deal. It's okay. It'll, it'll turn out okay, you know, in the end. And people comfort you, and sometimes their words aren't that comforting, and they don't really help that much, but you know, you appreciate them and take them for what they are, I suppose. Anyways, that's my two cents, I guess. I don't know, it's been a while for me. I could probably make another- I'll make another leftovers video about that when I have time. I apologize in advance, I won't get to annotate your video tonight, but I promise I'll actually do that, not like last time, where I didn't get to annotate it for like ever, and that was just really unfortunate. But yeah, I have so much to do tonight, and I need to go to bed in like half an hour if I have any chance at getting sleep. So, alright, I'm gonna head out. Good luck, okay? It'll be okay, girl. I love you. Text me if you need. Bye.